I just wonder whether this is the end of institutional data and executive search firms when we, when we look at the requirement to basically flush the data as soon as we're done using it. Does it mean that we can't keep search data year on year to help us deliver future searches, which is really our model right now. We rely heavily on information gathered during past searches for current and future work. So, so I'm, I'm happy to talk about it, I do want to no, say no, all no, that. Please, go. Yeah. Um, so Francesca, hi. I think, um, certainly, I think the sort of the mindset very much in executive search is this is our data. You know, this is stuff that we've collected, we've done this search, and you know, the practice is to go back to a search you've done before and, and use that information. Um, this is really a human rights piece of regulation, which is about people's rights over their own data. So. It's really thinking about, is it fair and is it right that you're holding that data, particularly if people don't know that you've got it? So it's a little bit of a mindset change to thinking about who does this actually, how do we get this data in the first place and do we have the right to actually use it? Yeah. So I, I think it is going to change um, the way that people work, but I think it's probably going to bring people back to a little bit more engagement than perhaps people have had of late is probably driving back to a little bit more of a model that were, you know, the sort of executive search model of about 20 years ago when people really did have engagement with the candidates and, and, and maintained that ongoing relationship. I think that that's probably going to be a driver going forwards. And I'll, I'll just add from, from a data perspective, I, I think what you want to assess is the data that you're holding on to all this time and you, you kind of hoard it, is that information that's really helping you? Or is it, uh, is it is this a great opportunity to go through from an audit and say, you know, I'm capturing this information, it's not really, it's not crucial to the search process, it's, it's more of a liability than an asset, and go back to more of that. Yeah, I completely agree. It's, it's, really information has been seen as a, an asset but actually now it's looking at is that now possibly a liability to you so it's that whole equation what used to be seen as an asset might now actually be a liability under the gdpr 